a lot of people have made comments or asked me questions about just exactly what the point of my channel was, how it got started, etc. And uh, my very first video I ever made was about a SARM back when they were the cool new thing three years ago, I think. And how it all started was my friend owned a supplement company and she was one of the first people to get the uh, YK11. So I put a video up online because it was pretty hard to find information on that SARM. And it was, you know, a fairly, I mean, they're all experimental, but uh, so I put that up and for a little while, not a lot of people watched it, but then it kind of took off and a lot of people were asking questions or they were private messaging me on some other form of social media. So it kind of led me to being like, well, I guess I should make more videos. And at the time, I actually hadn't taken any steroids before. I mean, sure, you can count the SARMs as some form of that, but actual anabolic steroids like the videos that I've made uh, that you guys have probably seen before. And it was almost kind of like documenting my experimental journey at the start and it's weird because a lot of these videos I filmed are for from over two plus years ago and for some reason they're just now taking off you know I have a couple videos that get around a thousand views a week which for somebody with uh, 700 something subscribers that's pretty good so a lot of those videos that you go back and see, they kind of seem out of place or people don't realize that those videos were made a such a long time ago where my views or opinions or experience with things are a little different than how I explain them in those videos. You know, people will be Mr. Detective and they'll watch one video and hear my opinions or what I say about something. And then they'll go to one of my more recent videos and they point out the contradictory statements about that. Which, you know, I, that's not totally unfair to do, but you got to realize that people change. They, they, they do new things. They form new opinions. They, they grow older. You know, I'm in my mid-20s, so how I feel about a lot of shit changes. How much I care about doing everything I can to get bigger and get a, a more impressive physique, it, it, how important that is to me isn't a constant, you know, I, I never got to a point to where I didn't really try on my body, I still look damn near the same I did back then, but just your priorities change, you know, and at this point in time, videos for me, I, I I'm not all that constant on it because it really is a job to do YouTube consistently and it's not it's not easy to do uh, I get about 50 plus comments a day and it's pretty hard to stay on top of uh, it's gotten to the point now to where I just can't get to them all every time I log on my internet browser it's just boom 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 it has this giant list that I uh, have to address so I don't know, it's it's kind of it's kind of strange because I can't really my videos I can't monetize them because of what I discuss the vast majority of the time in my videos and what the people want to hear. So that's why it's kind of funny when people criticize me like I'm just a fame whore or whatever else cuz like dude, well I'm not going to make any money off this shit ever. I literally put this content out there because people want me to, they ask me to, because there's not a lot of people that are willing to put themselves out there like this and openly discuss such compromising shit that I'm putting my life out here for everybody to be seen in the open and there's still a large percentage of people that can't respect that. And it just baffles me. I'm like, dude, I understand if you think steroids are stupid or you'd never, never do them or I'm stupid for doing them. Okay, I get it. But, like, why are you looking at these videos in the first place then? Are you really just uh, looking for people to make fun of? 
I mean, I guess that's what the basis of trolling is, but like, god damn, dude. Find something more fun or productive to do. Even if that is really fun for you, it just isn't... I don't get how it's fulfilling at all. But, I haven't made a video in a little while. I just have been sitting back and watching what people take interest in with my videos, which one is taking off more. And I wonder sometimes if I should make fitness videos, you know, me working out in the gym, but then people would just be like, oh, that's all you can lift? <laughs> and like, yeah, man, I'm not a strong guy. I just look a certain way. Sure, there are dudes that look really buff and are strong at the same time, but I'm just a physique guy, you know? I'm 6'3", 205 pounds. I'm, that is not a recipe to lift a lot of weight, but it's a recipe to have a good, lean, nice-looking physique. So I just roll with my strengths because I'm not a dude that's like super self-conscious and in denial where I'm like, no, I must be good at everything to impress everyone. Fuck that. But to the people that have supported me because you are in larger numbers than the people that make fun of me or, or throw hatred my way, and I'd like to say thank you to everybody that asks questions, that wants to know from my experience, that wants to learn. We're all here to learn and take things from people because we want to grow as humans. And if somebody had a rough experience with something, we want to save ourselves from having to deal with that same shit. And it's like, come on, man, use my experience, use my bad choices as a way to help you avoid having to deal with such things yourself. That's it. Why is it any more complicated than that? So, uh, I'll open the forum. If anybody has any sort of videos that you would like me to cover on something, I'm more than willing as long as I'm relatively knowledgeable in the area because I'm not a shill. If I don't have any experience on it, I'm not going to pretend that I do. So, thank you for anyone that's made it this far through the video, that's watched all my other videos, and I look forward to hearing from you guys.